Hey guys, so today's gonna be a little bit of a different one because I'm obviously in my car and uh, I'm not at my computer. <laughs> so there's that. And uh, I don't have a script or anything for this one. I don't have anything to pull up on the internet or you know, any kind of windows I can flip to because I'm just filming it on my phone. So I'm doing this first of all because I had a lot of school work to do today and then I have more I have to do and then my friend is having some people over and I, I've been making, I mean, I haven't got out and spent time with my friends in person in a while. I really have only been chilling on Twitch or whatever, or Discord. And so today I'm taking a break from that and um, we're gonna go, we're gonna chill, drink some beers, eat some food or something. And um, speaking of friends though, I think I'm, I think I'm gonna make this video about um, the type of people you hang out with. And like, you know, there's that saying, it's, it's like, when you hang with dogs, you get fleas. And, you know, like the implications of that, because I think we've all been, we've all been at points in our lives where we kind of maybe, might, we might have like gotten with the wrong crowd, you know? And me, I, where I'm from, you know, it's like, it was very clicked up, especially with the high schools. And people from one type of high school were a certain way, people from different high school was a different way. And it's like, they'd be like, oh, you're, you're one of those, you know? And like, but it's like, I think people would kind of just like sync up with one another and there's a lot of truth to it. It's like the herd mentality, you know, a lot of people, they, they meet people who are similar to them. And I think part of the reason why I'm starting this Twitch community is I want to find like other like-minded people. And I found that literally like people are like, there's some people who have already gravitated to that idea. And like, I don't know how to explain it, but like, I feel like there lately you meet I don't know if you've experienced this recently but it seems like there's been some kind of like shift where it's like some people just feel like way more out of touch than usual and some people like I don't know it's like let's let's just say I feel more I feel I feel like I have a lot of things in common with some people but then the people I don't have a lot in common with they really are seem like they seem further and further away from me. You know what I mean? That's probably the best way to put it. And I don't want to be like all mystical, like it's a super mystical thing. Like, oh my gosh, something, there's a shift happening in the universe. But uh, I don't know. I, not to be all pseudoscience and everything like that, but a lot of people actually think that's happening now. Probably has something to do with technology. Because that's, you know. But yeah, back to the whole thing about like, the people you hang out you hang out around you know like i'm sure you remember that you know you start talking like certain people when you hang out with them like there's a certain type of humor and like that and funny thing about this i'll actually this is a hill i'll die on where i talk about like people and relationships is like a lot of times if you're if you're a person who's really a product of their environment and let's say you meet because i've literally felt like this happened to me before but like say you you're hanging out with your friends and you go out to a bar, you know, and you meet somebody, um, they may be attracted to, like, maybe you guys are attracted to one another. And, you know, like, of course, alcohol lowers inhibitions. Like, when you're hanging out with people, you're, you know, you're, you feel more comfortable in a group and everything like that. But me personally, I always felt like when I met people and I was hanging out with my friends, like, I was acting different than how I normally am. And it really, like, I don't know it's an interesting thought but it's kind of a controversial thought because a lot of people would be like oh what so you're not being yourself you know but like how do you really ever know that you're being yourself you know it's like they're in psychology you know which that which i study it's like there's the whole self-report data and then there's like observer you know they, the way you think of yourself is probably a lot different than how you actually are and like you know so that's why it's good to have like feedback from other people like sometimes like yo am i am i tripping right now or is this like the way that it is you know it's like sometimes we're all, we're misguided and blinded by our own self perceptions and stuff it's like it's helpful to have like a sounding board i think but um i think that yeah people i can't I'm, it sucks i'm not gonna be able to edit this video so i'm sorry if i like pause a whole lot but like I said, I'm posting every single day, no matter what. And I have 20 more minutes till my dental appointment. So I'm not gonna make it a 20 minute video, but six more minutes or at least a couple more minutes, right? But yeah, I really think it's like with the people that you resonate, the people that you resonate with, I mean like, 
you know, a lot of people obviously need some sort of companionship. I'm not saying like don't have friends, but I, I do want to say this. Be very careful of who you're spending your time with. That's probably the best way I could put it. Because, you know, when you consider it, I've, I've recently been into this thing called like the law of accumulation, where it's like when you think of life as like a ledger, like you have negative things you do, like and positive things you do. You're going to be on a, it's this really simple concept if you think about it, like you're going to be in a better place in your life if all the positives, the positive efforts that you put in start to outweigh the negatives. You know, I'm not saying like, is it, you know, it's a funny thing with the, I'll ramble for a second here, whole thing with like the new, new year's resolution. People's problem is always like they, they try to like recreate their entire lives as their new year's resolution and it doesn't work. Like you need to compromise with yourself and be like, okay, I will keep smoking, I will drink, but you know maybe I'll cut back a little bit and I'll maybe I'll have a plan to like make sure that I keep doing this, right? But, what was I talking about? Um, oh man, I rambled a little too far there. Well, I'll still upload the video anyways. I'm also getting messages from my group that I go to school with and they're like talking to me about the assignment. But um, yeah, no, here, oh, you know what? Actually, that's a good point to make. I'll, I'll cut myself off. I don't even remember what I was talking about, but I'll, I'll finish it with this one. Uh, you know, when you're in a group project with anybody, whether it's in your job or your life, you know, do you want to like when if you're with a group of people who aren't motivated, you know, it's it's hard for you to stay motivated because, you know, like, you know, you don't have the support of your peers like you. You literally have to do this yourself, you know, but when you have people who are on the same page as you and you're going through an endeavor, you know, it's like, you know, that you actually have support. And but like it all comes down to like the people that you're surrounding yourself with because you can't ask somebody to change like they you can't be in their waiting room sitting there with them if they don't want to change then they're not going to it's up to them and that's fine you know it's okay you can't you can't force anybody to do anything you can only change your own behavior but you know so and you know of course you have to surround yourself with some people that's like sometimes sometimes it's it's inevitable and you know but i'm talking about those times when you can choose who you actually spend time around and you know there's that whole thing of like again not to get too like all woo woo i'm just spitballing here today i don't have a lot of structure to this video and i'm really distracted by this notification on my phone but um give me two seconds just fast forward the video if you if i take more than two seconds but Oh, lost my train of thought again. Uh, must not have been that important. But yeah, I mean, that's been eight minutes. It's a good day. I hope you guys are having a good day too. Uh, maybe I'll, I'll rewatch the video and remember what I was going to say. And I'll end the next video with what I was going to say in this video. But yep, that's it. All right. Uh, yeah, be careful who you hang out around. Um, I think that their energy, you know, affects you in ways that you don't understand. And, uh... If you're gonna pursue an endeavor, make sure you have the, the right people around you. And that's all I'm gonna say. All right, have a good one, bye-bye.